Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Thanks for joining me. I have a wonderful stretch routine prepared for you. So we'll start on our mat and a butterfly stretch. Just bring the soles of your feet together. Stay rooted in your seat. And you can gently use your elbows to press into your knees to feel that expansion in your hips. I like to take a gentle sway from side to side as well, just to feel even more grounded in this stretch. We'll start to roll our neck and our head in a circular motion, really sending your head all the way down towards your chest and your head all the way back. Feel that full stretch along all sides of your neck. Take a big inhale as you reach your arms long above your head, and then an exhale for a tricep stretch. Reach your left palm towards your right elbow. Stretch along the back side of your right arm. Press your right palm towards your back to get a little deeper into the stretch. Inhale, lift your arms above your head and we'll reverse that towards the opposite side. Send your left palm towards your back. Reach your right hand for your left elbow. Deeply stretch your left tricep. Inhale as you reach your arms above your head and we'll take on a nice twist. Send your left palm towards your right knee. Take your gaze towards the back of the room and stay grounded in your seat. Press into your tailbone to lengthen through your lower spine. And now you'll take this twist towards the other side. Send the crown of your head towards the ceiling and your gaze over your opposite arm. Really twist through your core. Continue to breathe. And now you'll start to position yourself to send your legs parallel down your mat. Inhale your arms above your head and exhale, seated forward fold. I like to do this with my knees bent to alleviate any pressure on my lower back. This will also help you get a little deeper into your hamstrings. So just do whatever feels best to you and in your body. You'll extend through your lower spine to send your chest closer towards your thighs. It helps send your forehead towards your knees. You'll start to rise up and reposition yourself into a wide leg forward fold. Start to walk your palms down the center of your mat and send your forehead down towards the floor. You should feel a really deep stretch along your inner thighs here. On each inhale, you'll flatten through your spine a little bit more. 
And on each exhale, send your chest closer towards your mat. Try to keep your knees facing upwards. You can also point or flex through your feet. Just try to protect your knee. Inhale to center and exhale towards the right side. You'll stretch your left arm and hand towards your right foot. Square your chest so that your right arm is parallel to your right leg. Once again, you can flex through your feet to protect your knee joint here. Inhale, center and exhale towards the opposite side. Now you should feel a deep stretch along the right side of your body. Continue to square your chest. Parallel your arms towards your left leg. And take nice deep inhales and exhales to help you get deeper into your stretch. Now you'll send your left foot towards the inner part of your right thigh. Square your chest and send your forehead towards your right knee. Flatten through your spine as much as you can to send your chest closer towards your right knee. Start to really warm the body up. And now you'll switch towards the opposite side. You also still have the option to bend into your left knee if you need to help getting deeper into your stretch. This should also alleviate any pressure on your lower back. We'll start to swing our legs around and come to lie on your stomach. Press into your palms and lift your chest away from your mat. Press firmly into your palms to feel some expansion in your chest. Circle your head. Release any tension that might be built up on your neck or your spine. Squeeze into your glutes and press firmly into the tops of your feet. Start to release down and grab for the outer soles of your feet. Take on a nice stretch on your right quad by squeezing your right foot towards your bottom. Inhale through your nose and exhale out through your mouth. Now we'll take your left hand towards your left foot, stretching through your left quad. Keep your gaze down to protect your neck. Squeeze the heel of your foot closer towards your body on each exhale. Now roll over onto your back, bringing your knees towards your chest. Feel that release of your hip flexors. Point and flex through your feet. Massage your lower back by swaying side to side.
You'll take on a nice supine twist, so drop both of your knees towards your left side and you'll look towards your right palm. Try to ground through both shoulder blades into your mat. Twist through your core. And just try not to force it, let this naturally happen. This is a great detox for your spine. So just inhale to lengthen and exhale to twist a little deeper. You'll send your knees towards your chest. And then drop your knees towards the opposite side on your next exhale. Take your gaze now over your left palm. Press your right shoulder blade into your mat. And just drop both knees towards the opposite side. Continue to quiet your mind. Enjoy the stretch. Let go of any of the chatter in your thoughts. Allow yourself to be present here. Focus on your breath. Start to roll back towards a flat spine, squeezing your knees towards your chest and exhale into a Shavasana corpse pose. Take a moment here to unwind, to let go, feel your body sink into your mat. Quiet your mind. Allow yourself to feel the full release. Unclench your jaw. Let go of any tension. And you can stay in your Svabhasana as long as you like. Thank you so much for joining me today for a nice stretch. I hope you've enjoyed it. And if you did, please like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much. This is Amira. And I hope you'll join me on the next one. Thank you. Namaste.